Namaste. As always, you worry about the time you you love this world. Subscribe, or Bell so that you'll get updates for our new video. Hello everyone, we are back again. Oh. We are live reaction. Yes. It's doing reaction videos for you everyone. Yes. So Hope you st stay cool. Yes. yes. We'll always um, be here doing reaction with you, so always stay safe and always watch our videos. So again, don't forget that's Love Train's reaction. Yes. Yeah, so today's video that we're going to react is about how to build the Statue of Unity in India. So yes. this is my first time to know that India has uh, the Statue of Unity, right? So, Absolutely. Yeah, we are really exciting doing and making reaction in this kind of video today. This video reaction is requested by our subscribers. And if you have any recommendation video, please post the link below. below. And always uh, leave your comments as well. Like the video and yes. don't forget to um, share and subscribe to Love Trends Reaction. Uh, without further ado, let's find out to watch the video. It's just a 7 minutes video, right? Yes, addition is a strong. It's united as weak as it's divided. Wow, so very um, strong. This is a history of... 71 years into independence. Despite the obstacles in its way, India has clearly chosen the path of unity. Wow. When the British left India, there were 565 princely states with the option of joining India, Pakistan, or remaining independent. The mammoth task of integrating each princely state with the dominion of India fell upon the shoulders of one man, Sardar Vallabhai Patel, Whoa. our That's first Deputy Sardar. Prime Minister right. and Home Minister. He so made the impossible Prime Minister. possible. Yes. History called him the Iron Man of India, mm. the Iron. great unifier. Wow, very fabulous, right? Yeah. Fittingly, his birthday on 31st October is marked as Rashtriya Ekta Divas. It has been a long-standing dream of our Prime Minister, Sri Narendra Modi, to pay tribute to the great Sardar Patel. On 31st October 2013, Sri Narendra Modi, the then Chief Minister of Gujarat, laid the foundation for the tallest statue in the world. Mm. Wow. The Statue of, of Unity. Unity. 182 in meters. keeping with its ethos, yes. LMT took up the challenge head on. Located on Sadhu Bed, 3.5 kilometers from the Sardar Sarovar Dam on the Narmada, the Statue of Unity is an unparalleled confluence of engineering and art. Wow. Mm. Although LMT yeah, had successfully fabulous. completed a plethora of prestigious projects, including power plants and commercial complexes, a structure of such scale was one of a kind. See, 180 meters. The honor of sculpting Sardar Patel's likeness went to Padma Bhushan Award, Sri Ram Sutar. The first challenge was to select an apt pose and expression to do justice to him. Although LNT's role was that of an EPC contractor, they still took active interest in the selection process. Extensive discussions with historians and experts ensued. After sifting through thousands of photographs, the team was unanimous in how the Ooh. statue should look. Yes. You they heard us? Yeah, they choose. Um, Shiram Sakar created sculptures in varying sizes, honing every detail again and again. The latest 3D scanning techniques and computer-controlled production ensured accurate reproduction of minute details. Whoa! Very fascinating, right? Immense statues yeah, look at the world the, over look at have a broad height. base to achieve structural stability. Yes! Sardar Patel statue was slated to be the tallest ever and the greatest the task wow. was to achieve the design. The dhoti needed to end above the ankle. He is in a walking stance. Thus the feet were not parallelly aligned. The assertive stride 
met a gap between the feet. But the LNT team was equal to the task. Ooh. Operations commenced yes. in 2013 they with extensive in 2013, searches for land, right? riverbed, river, and wind. This was followed by critical engineering design, a test of LNT's experience and technical capability. In such a remote location, planning and logistics would wow. be the key to all the operations. It's the good to hold that. campaign yes. was launched in Earth. I believe it's a with very a view beautiful to record impression. used yes. implements donated by farmers around friendly. the country as a symbolic tribute. To build that statue. This iron forms yes. the steel rebar in the raft foundation. Oh. A homage to the Iron Man of India. A reinforced concrete core created with critical concreting methods gave the structure a stable base. This would support the primary and secondary steel trussing. The bronze plates then covered the entire structure, forming the sculpture. Locally available sandstone and Baswara marble has also been used. Marbles. Besides the statue, other key elements like the memorial and visitor center, main access bridge, bridges and roads were made to precision. The Shresht Bharat Bhavan is a three-star facility for the tourists and guests. To bring socio-economic development to the region, students and vendors from nearby villages and towns were also trained for the project, thereby generating ample employment. Highly trained, right? The ultra-modern BIM technology for the design and project monitoring brought synchrony between the team and 30 consultants globally. The statue houses two 200 tons suspended tuned mass dampers to make it stable mm, enough to withstand violent winds plus seismic activity. There are very fine created macro panel right? assemblies yes. on site for the smaller micro panel bronze castings. This ensured speed and seamless assembly. Every plate was unique and RFID tagged and bolted in its place. Mm. As work progressed at blazing speed, the engineered structure transformed and the statue began to take shape. Wow. Mm. Designers, so, engineers, experts, specialists and workers from different parts of India mm. have toiled night and day in a united effort unto one goal. The Statue of Unity. Wow. Very possible enough yes. to remind future generations of his epochal contribution. A structure as enduring as the vision of modern Indian nationhood. As Sardar Vallabhai Patel himself said, Mankind without unity is not a strength. Only when yeah, harmonized true. by unity does it become a spiritual power. That's right, yes. Very good. Very well said, right? So that's it? How oh, very fascinating and very very fabulous to watch this kind of statue of unity and angel. Yes, for me. So I really uh, don't expect to uh, India to have that uh, kind of statue. Absolutely. So, yes, yeah, so I imagine me too. twice the size of the Statue of Liberty in yes. the U.S. So it's really a giant um, statue, right? Statue in all over the world. Yes, and. I am also having fun watching the video, so again, you can actually see how they uh, work together in building the City of Unity United, so as what you said a while ago, engineers, specialists, so workers really united to uh, successfully build that kind of uh, tallest statue in the world. Yes. So how you imagine that, uh, what kind of plans that they have in just, um, creating, building uh, this, that kind of statue against every kind of wither. Yes, right? I, I believe the engineers are very, very fascinating. Intelligent, yes. yes, yes. So, uh, they have very talented engineers, workers, so they are really um, doing their best in building a statue of unity. Yes, and very good to watch. And the results, of course, are very beautiful. So Absolutely. I believe until today, 2022, that's still very beautiful. We are so very proud of engineers in India. And not engineers, all the other profession that you have, very good.
Yes, that's right. So keep up the good work and also we are really um, doing our best also to give you fun and um, reactions video. Yes. Again, if you have any recommendation video, please put the like below. See you on next video. Take care and get us. Yeah.